Boom. Boom. Let me tell you, I am actually counting days in literally 20, 29 days. Mm. 29 days. Yes. What's happening in 29 it's days? It's all about Qatar, my G. Yo! Kicking off the feast of football, my G. Bro, I am very, very excited. We're talking about a total of 64 matches. 64 games. Now, if you love football the way we do, the only place to catch your vibe in Qatar is with DSTV. Yeah, man. Mm. Listen, uh, you've got your decoder. I got my decoder. You've got your app, your DVS I've app. I've got my app. Yes. Yeah. Listen, I'm going to buy a decoder. No, Actually, no, I don't, don't have, have a decoder. One. I don't have a decoder. Oh, the thing is, the good thing about it is right yeah. now, if you want to get yourself a decoder, mm-hmm. DSTV, I've got decoders going for just 3999 Bob. And I suggest yep. you get a DSTV approved installer. Mm. Don't oh. be like me. Remember that one that I bought? Oh, from yeah. That was, <laughs> that, was a, that was a long thing. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, man. So man. in about uh, a couple of 29 days, to be more precise, we're going to be in Qatar. Yes. And it's all about Chachisha Mechi in... In Qatar. With I thought you guys would say it. Uh, oh. In Calisto. <laughs> Chachisha <laughs> Mechi in Qatar. Qatar. With DSTV. DSTV. And Love they it. are sponsoring today's podcast. Make sure you sign up. Boom. The mics are blood clad open. Check, check, check. Select accent for the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Calvin. Calvin always late. <laughs> All right, it is the mics are open. My name's G Money. Ashley. Big C. Episode 181. 181. Andy's still on leave, a well deserved leave. <laughs> oh, yep. yeah. Like, it's his birthday. Happy yeah. happy belated birthday. Happy birthday to Andy. Take yep. some time off because it's his birthday. Yep. Do you birthday do week. Do you? I don't take time off when it's my birthday. My birthday is coming up next weekend. Are you are you off? No. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> like 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 my birthday falls on a Saturday. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What's happening? Well. Don't yeah. miss the days. Oh, take the Friday off. Friday. Oh, yeah. I don't know, but man. But without a job, we don't need to. You, but also, yeah. ten o'clock. Yeah. October, yeah. October October babies are so privileged because they have holidays back to back. What? They then literally. Oh, but we are in radio. You can't take. Man. <laughs> man. It doesn't mean that it's it's a holiday. L- you have. Listen, holiday too. I've got a question for you guys. So we're recording this, right? right? Coming Monday, I was talking to Austin. Austin always knows. Listen, if you're ever on Twitter and you want to confirm whether your <laughs> holiday's been gazetted at Austin, Otieno. Yes. Yes. That's on Twitter. That's your guy. Those fake, uh, what are they called? Holiday Gazettes. Notice. No, no, no. You know? So I was asking him, my guy, you know Diwali, man? Monday. Is it holiday? He says no. No. no he but says no. It, listen, Indians need to sign up. Indians need to style up. Let me tell you, fam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, fam, us Christians, we give you Christmas, yep. Easter. Yeah. Yep. The ascension, the descension, all kind of things. Everything. Whatever, whatever they're called. Like, all we need fam, is curry. Bro, well. look, we give you four days at Christmas. Bro. Right? We give Eid. Listen, let me tell you. Ramadan, right? These yep. guys, the Muslims, they have Eid. They have two. Two they of have them. another one. Like, yeah. After, you for, after you've forgotten about fasting. Yeah, they're like, boom. <sighs> you come one. back. Yeah. What the fuck are you Indian people doing? You get come your, through, man. Together. Listen, you can't just give us samosas and chapatis. We want all And curry. Well. Don't forget curry. Don't forget and curry. curry. And yeah. Diamond Plaza. Come through. Plans. Listen, this is our plea. Can we write a letter to the president and yeah. actually say... We, who are, they're actually a part of the, the, what is it, the 49th tribe of yes. Kenya? Yeah. Yes. Right? Write to the president and say, we deserve a holiday. Yeah, they come through. Come through. And you know why as well? Because you know, those niggas are going to be keeping us up on Monday with fireworks. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's true. So while they're partying and enjoying their day off, <laughs> us guys are going to be like, can you noisy neighbors please stop? Wait, it's, let me ask. So in an office, do Indians actually get time off during the Yeah, yeah, they do. So only them specifically? Mm-hmm. Yo. Us, Oh. Most of the time, they own the office. Oh, that is. So it doesn't even matter. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. So Indians don't go to work on Diwali. Yeah, they don't. It just just like there's that other uh, Muslim holiday Fam. where you're actually supposed to, you know, guys be wearing Kanzu the week before. Oh, yeah. Just like, <laughs> you know salam like I'll be when, yo. <laughs> when, I was at, when I was at primary school, we used to have a Diwali song. I've just remembered it. It used to go like, Diwali is here. Why are you Diwali not shaking your head? 
Happy do sarai. Give me a red dot. Give me a red dot. You know how yeah, happy this like is a Bollywood movie. You gotta go like. You gotta go like. Yeah. Happy Diwali. Happy Bro. Diwali. What the fireworks? <laughs> By the way, though, you know Bollywood is the one. Yo, Yo, I watch so many. Wait, I have watched so many Bollywood movies. You're your mic, puppy, because yeah. you can't. Sorry, I watched so many Bollywood movies when I was a kid. Like literally, uh. my auntie used to take us to the theater. To watch Bollywood, Bollywood movies. I used to know all the dance moves. Really? I could sing. True story. I, True I watched story. Singy the other day. Um, who, Slumdog Millionaire. Yeah. That's not Bollywood. That's not Bollywood. Oh, oh, that's a holy bully. Who? Oh, that's holy bully. <laughs> hey, I watched Slumdog Millionaire. Listen, you know, have you watched it? There's yeah. that part the guy has to go into the latrine. Yeah, I was just like, nasty. no. Okay. Oh, that's 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 crazy. But bro, you know. Can you you know these gun movies like a, a mm, huge amount yeah, of yeah. Indian movies is the dopest. Yeah, but I will shoot you, but not before that. <laughs> I, I love the the way they the have to musicals. pause and they have to dance. Like, <laughs> oh, have you have you been for Indian weddings though? Yo, I haven't though. They're oh. lit. They're lit, man. Really? They can Yo. go for like five days yeah. or some shit. Really? And they yeah. do like full on events. So wait, they can go for five days and they can't give us one holiday. <laughs> one day. Listen, Your Indian day. weddings are actually serious. And those serious. guys spend the money yeah, for yeah, yeah. this wedding. I know, I, know, I know some guys who literally, but they're, they're like loaded, loaded. Bro, they took out the whole of Tribe Hotel for their guests. Uh, really? I was just like, damn. But also, on the flip side, don't isn't it the man that gets the... Yeah. Indians, Bro. Are, Indians are selfish. By this. the way, <laughs> Indians, you guys are selfish and like... But let's be honest but with you, you guys. Right. But, but no, so, 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 so you, you were saying that who, the, who the pays for the goes to the man, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, but of course, it's just 99 cents. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <laughs> discount today. Discount today. <laughs> Shout out to your guest Punjab. Oh, oh, that's, <laughs> that's actually funny. It's just 99 cents. It's just 99 you know, we cents. should actually go watch a, a, a Bollywood movie. That would be dope. Yeah. Actually, shout out to Nimrat. Nimrat has been telling us when something cool comes out in cinema right. that she can actually like fuck with, she'll let us know. We should go oh, watch but, one. But, but here's, here's the thing. What are the top three things that the Indian community has given us? Ooh. Diamond Plaza. <laughs> Bagias, 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 Samosas and chapos. What more? Just four. Like, Even yeah. the candies lit. Oh my I god! Like I am so disappointed really? with you what? guys. Sorry. Where's Kama Sutra? Oh wow! They gave us that. <laughs> it's, is it? It's yeah. That's Indian. Kama Sutra. It's not Indian. Oh wow! It is right. It, it really is. is. Like these guys oh. were like curry, Bagias. By the way, by the way, Indians are freaks. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they have a whole book on position. Yeah, 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 yeah. Indians are free. Actually, if you see, the, actually, come to think about it, the original books usually have them in like their little long dresses. <laughs> that guy opened yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, wait, wait, open all it. All I want, it shows all I want. you how to have sex with quotes on. <laughs> all, I, all I want from our Indian community is an hour holiday. Just one. Let Diwali, let, like, if it's not Diwali, give us another one. Candle of Lights or, or Curry Christmas or something. Just give us something. Curry Christmas. I wow. just made it up. <laughs> Slightly racist, but <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Listen, yo, we're not trying to get cancelled, man. You know, here's the thing. Mm. Yo, I saw guys on Monday, everyone, I, like, I asked guys, yo, are you guys in support of Drink Chumps the, deleting the, the interview with yeah. Kanye West? Mm. Everyone was like, ooh. We don't well, want to talk no, about let's, it. Let's talk about No, I'm glad you said into that. Let's talk about Kanye West. Man. Yeah. Fam, Kanye you, West. You know, this is the first time mm. I have seen diehard Kanye West fans, fans say yeah. nope. too much. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, yeah. what the actual fuck? It's a hot mess. Kanye West, man. Um, Kanye doesn't need a platform. He needs help. That's true. That's true. Fam, for but, those of you who don't follow... Kanye West actually came out and said on a on a drink jam interview, which is now being taken down from YouTube, Three hour. Yeah. where he actually said that George Floyd wasn't killed by the cop with yeah, the yeah, knee yeah. on his neck. Yep. He was yep. killed by a drug called fentanyl. Fam. Bro, like even me, you know, I'm always defending Kanye. Yeah. Like, like I went and Googled that story because, yeah. you know, there was a rumor about it when right. George Floyd died, right? Mm. There's a whole various articles. Yeah. Mm. Even the police did a whole clarification autopsy, about, yeah. yeah, autopsy and everything. And I was just like, yo, Kanye, bro, he went in on everything. everything. Fuck Diddy, Mick Mill. Yeah. And the thing about what? it is, the, th the, thing, the thing about it is, right, that George Floyd situation, right? Like, I don't remember, I don't, 
I think guys don't remember how that made us Yo, feel at the time. That, yeah. Fam, of all of the of all of the crimes against black folk in my lifetime, and I've seen quite a few growing mm. up in the UK, you know, Stephen Lawrence being killed by some youths. But that George Floyd thing where a white cop mm. sat went on this man's neck for eight minutes and forty six seconds. Yeah. Yo, I, 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 Kanye, Kanye was like for me. He, you know, when you when you you start hammering something, mm-hmm. right? The nail goes through, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. And you're just like, okay, cool. I don't think one nail is gonna be. Let it. me do another. Let me one. get another nail. Yeah. When he went on and said, "Yo," when George Flynn was saying was saying, "Mama," he, was he wasn't. His girlfriend. I'm like, bro, what the fuck, fam? I know. And the thing about it is, it's like as podcasters ourselves, I look at the situation. Like, imagine us in, in mm. Nori's mm. Situation, situation, like, okay, yeah. if we have a crazy interview, like, like you may not have noticed it, but I had to edit last week's interview because some things were said. Mm. <laughs> but, like, um, if we have a crazy interview, comes in here and says a load of stuff, yeah. there's an element where it's the public interest to put it out there. But if this person is not in their <coughs> right state of, state of mind, do we have a responsibility to... To not put it out. Because I think we the, do. the worst thing that Nori could have done is put it out and then take it back. Yeah. You get me? Because what, I think what made it worse is he came out and he was just like, listen, we put it out anyway. Plus, like the episode has gotten more views than a football, than football on yeah. a Sunday. And people got so mad because they were just like, we're literally telling you we don't appreciate the content that you put out. We're your audience and you're out here telling, uh, talking shit to us. Mm. Like there are limits to this shit, I believe. I think. Yeah. Th- I, I think for me, um, why, why do you think they pull it down? I'm so, so, Googling. so there's so many things in the but background, right? You know, the there's there's, <laughs> there's the con obviously George Floyd, the yeah. anti-Semitic what what do you call them mm. uh, comments, right? Mm. But more importantly, right, like watching no listening to Nori on Hot ninety seven apologize for it, right? Mm. And him trying to say it all started on Sunday, by the way, when he was like, "Listen, guys, mm. don't watch the snippets. It's three hours." I did try right. and check him and everything, mm. but for me, as now a journalist, right, I mm. saw what was wrong in all of that. Because yeah. Kanye West was coming in hot already, mm. hot off the press. Mm. He's won the T-shirt, White Lives Matter, yes. right? Yes. All of those, you could tell where he was at. Yeah, you know, even right. in in in. Uh, the whole background what Nori was saying how Kanye West uh, he didn't want him to walk off and all of that but for me as a trained journalist I was like bro that interview was Mm. not perfect in the sense that you can't interview Kanye West rumbling and saying all of these things Mm. under the influence Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You get valid, yeah, because right. he was he, at some point like when now Norris starts to check him, bro. He's slurring, yeah, right. He's like, Oh, you know, Kanye, let me finish, let me finish. Mm. I was like, Bro, that was a that's fucking hot mess. Mm. That was for me. I feel like now that's when your producer, right, who who now needs to be able, like, who needs to say, Guys, uh uh-uh, uh, I think no, 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 chill because mm. this shit is not gonna end well, yeah, right, yeah. So for me, I was just like. Uh, no, 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 no. It, it it wasn't responsible. Yeah, it and wasn't. Al- and also, it's like I mean, uh, I mean, it's not responsible. But also, it's a case of like, as somebody quite rightly said here, they said, "Listen, they're in two minds as to whether the interview should have been out because you know, if he'd spoken about black people killing black people and the ops and the block and stuff, nobody would have taken it down. True, but because of the People are saying, you're saying you took it down because of George Floyd, but we really know you took it down because of the remarks that he made against Jewish people. Mm. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Mm. So it's one of those ones where like, okay, it was taken down, but why did you take it down? Because yeah. I saw I saw a thingy from Hot 97 give a whole, um, what's his name? The 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 guy. Ebro. Not Ebro. Rosenberg? Rosenberg. He went on a whole rant, right? I didn't quite pay attention about it, but he also went on the Jew side, right? Mm. And spoke about it and everything. But I can see... But he's a Jew, he's Jewish. He, he's yeah, Jewish, right? And that takes you back to the UK when who With did Wiley. what? <laughs> Wiley, right? Mm. It's it's a known thing. Yeah. You get, so there's so many... You know, here's the thing about the media. So there's, there's known unknowns. Fam, let me tell you. I'm going to tell you the truth. Mm. And I'm going to be honest with you. Yeah. In all of my years of broadcasting and even on the podcast and all of these things, Fam, I can honestly say, having worked in the music industry and having, you know, been around the music industry for a long time, 
Entertainment. Entertainment industry for a long time, from back then till now. It's random. There by. are some things I'm just not you talking about. You can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm not talking about it because of fear. Or because yeah. Well, maybe it's fear. I'm not talking about it because of fear. But it's just at the end of the day, it's like, if you have eyes, you see. Mm. Right? If you, if you have eyes, you see that whatever happens. You know, it, you mm, see. Mm. You know? At the end of the day, it's like, I, I'm not into selective suffering. Mm. And I... I feel deeply and I empathize for the entire, for anyone on the planet who's going through anything. Yeah. You know? But I, I, it's a valid point here. Someone says if Kanye had been speaking about killing the ops from 63rd and 2nd, 64th Street, that's acceptable. But if you mentioned Jewish conglomerates, then it's not acceptable. Mm. So it's, it's one of those ones, man. It's like, I don't know. There were, I think there were very many triggers generally mm. in the whole interview. So like right. even pinpointing like specific ones. And that's why I think he was saying, watch the whole three hour, yeah. Um, yeah. Three hour uh, podcast. But well, that's Nori, people, people are going to pick out what they want to pick out. But, but Nori, we watched the whole three hours. It didn't make it no any context. easier yeah. Yeah, 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 to digest. Bro, it's, it's if down. If you're looking for context, <laughs> but, it wasn't but what there. Next, what next for Kanye? Because you know, it's like I played a song on the radio this week. You know that song by Dead Press? It's mm. bigger than hip hop, hip hop, hip -hop yeah. that classic joint. Yeah. And I was just re going through the album with Dead Press. Didn't even realize that Kanye had some production credits on that mm. album. Yeah. Mm. Bro, Kanye's like, bro, like I, I was on, on, on the show last week, right? On the vault, I was doing um, Be Common. Mm. Him oh, and Jay Dilla. Wow. Bro, like, I was just going through it and I'm just like, fucking Kanye West. Kanye. The other day, <laughs> um, so Zilla. at and some Jay point Zilla. at some point this week, I think Tuesday, right? It was officially the one-year commemoration of Kanye West uh, changing his name legally mm -hmm. from yeah. Kanye to Ye. Mm. Bro, on the show, so I do that thing where? Today in music history. And that mm. just felt some type of way. Like, I was looking for Kanye West song from, like, back in the day because that's the Kanye I want to be in touch yeah. with. Right. Yeah. You get? Because I'm just like... But to answer your question, what next for Kanye? It took me back. All of this Kanye, right? I remember a day G and I were doing the show and G told me, bro, two things. <clears throat> Kanye West lost his mom, went mm. crazy. The second bit, and I remember you said it, was when Ka Kim Kardashian leaves Kanye. Mm. Yeah, but I, I, I said that. You said that? Yeah. yeah. That and was it. Happened. And it's happened because if you look at what Kanye's done, yes, there was that whole, they were still together with Kim, yeah. right? You know, when he went to that whole ranch and everything. Yeah. And then now things spiraled way right. more right. right after. Right. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, your brother made a very valid point. I feel like. About him being on his own level. He, there has to be guys he needs to connect mm. with. Like I don't know, that, like you know, th this is what makes me. This is what makes me question it. Like, are they friends with Jay Z? But then again, I look at it from a perspective of knowing people I'm friends with. Yeah. At times, you can't. Well, I mean, you can't reel them in. And yeah. You know is, what I mean? This is what I always say. Like, you can uh, people can offer you help. That's fine. Mm. But it's until you actually want that help that mm, you're mm. actually going to be helped. Because so many people have honestly tried to, even when he was in the ranch, how many people went out even and saw Dave him? Chappelle Dave went. went. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So many people tried when, to help him yep. and then he, he kind of stabilized at some point. Then, mm. as you said, the spiral just went <laughs> off because mm. now he's just like, you know what? Fuck everybody. We're not, I'm not trying to be on the same, on the same level as them. Yeah, so if you can only, if you want the help or if you actually think you need it, that's the only time you're actually mm. going to be helped. Yeah. Man, Kanye I, West. I know. Anyway, prayers. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Prayers yeah. You, know, Kanye, you know, as, as we transition, you know, billionaire Kanye West. I, I love how he said, I'd be dating girls differently. I buy yeah. them bugs to houses. I was I like, <clears throat> okay. Yo, there were niggas out there being like, yo, Kanye. <laughs> <laughs> yo, buy me a house, nigga. Yo, but, but, but now that we're talking about billionaires, how you guys feeling? Declare your wealth. Ah, honey. How you By guys way, feeling? How much, do you think you're, how much do you think you're worth? My own or my family? <laughs> Bro, like, no. I, like, I don't know. It's a, it's a, it's an interesting question. Mm. Uh, man. I don't know how much I'm worth. How much? To the, to, like, in terms of cash flow to... I put to them all everything. together. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm worth, I'm worth a conservative effort, mm -hmm. 125 million. US? Yeah, no, Kenyan shillings. Oh, that's good. That's good. That yeah. one point something. You Yo, got more money than Soldier Boy. <laughs> By the way, I'm joking. 
<laughs> Here's the truth. The, so maybe maybe 500k of that is real. The rest I plan to steal. <laughs> Man. That's smart. That's smart. It's 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 crazy. Have like, you seen our politicians? Yeah. Bro. bro. Listen, that's why I'm a broke bitch, but I'm, I have a very bright future. Ah, very you're, rich future. You're yeah. Yeah. You don't need money. You'll be all right. You'll be all right. I'm good. But, but, but man, I think the one that caught my attention the most was, um, of course, um, vetting of the prime cabinet secretary. Mm. Right. So, first of all, let's give some context. Okay. Maybe not everybody mm. is across this. The reason mm. we're talking about how much you might be worth is because this week in Kenya, um, politicians about having who mm. want to join the next government in government positions are being vetted by parliament. Yep. And... As part of their vetting, they have to be declaring how much they're actually worth, and the figures are mad. Astronomical, That's man. Mm. Yeah. So, so let's run it down. Um, um, Modavidi. Modavidi, four point four. Four point four billion. Now, yeah. can we stop wow. there for a moment? Mm-hmm. Can we have a moment of silence for that four point four billion? <laughs> because let me tell you, that four point four billion right now is pissed off, bro. It's pissed off. Why? Like, it's sitting in. The, it's that that four point four billion saying, nigga. Why are you still at work? <laughs> Sit your ass back at so, home. Honestly, Use me. Do you know, no, <laughs> honestly, let, let's break down 4.4 billion. That's 33 million US dollars. Bro, yep. you know, like, let me, yep. let me, to show you guys that I was so vested in this story, right? The last thing I checked on XC Converter, look, <laughs> is what? <laughs> 4 billion. How much is 4 oh, billion? How much is like, oh, it 30, says 33, 33 million dollars. 33 million dollars. Like, I was just like, now, what? I'm going to ask v- you. Uh, Truth, zoom that shit. Look, XC Converter. <laughs> no word of a lie. Like the other day, I was like, this nigga said four billy. I'm gonna ask you, and I'm gonna ask, and I'm gonna ask everyone in the room, and I'm gonna ask everyone watching this podcast today. Mm. If I have four point four billion Kenyan shillings, yeah. thirty three million USD, USD, fam, why am I still struggling to work? If you have thirty three million dollars, right? And let's say you get to put it in bonds mm-hmm. with a per annum of... 12%? Of, of, of 10, 12? 10, 12%. Yeah. Bro, you're good. You're looking at like three milli... Every year. Every year. USD. That's that... Which you, can't, which you can't spend. And my thing mm. is, at the end of the day, like oh, I, wow. maybe, maybe I don't understand public service, but what... Fam, give me... Like, honestly, and I know guys will be saying, I don't have any ambition, right? <laughs> But give me a million US or two million US. Say two million US. Okay. I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, and you know what? The reason I'm done, uh, when I, the reason I'm going to say I'm done is because I want this phase of my life to be about enjoyment. About enjoying the work that I've put in. Valid. Like, you know, <coughs> picture being, picture being, because these men in their 60, 70, 60, 60 yeah. some. He's around 64 or 60 around, And that's yeah. the thing. Picture when do that. they enjoy their lives? Because they have been working all their lives. Guys. And you have that much money. Bro, listen, no, 33 what, what, million USD. You're making USD. money to do what? Yo, listen, me, I just want to get to 100 million. You yeah. know, like that song for Rick, Rick Ross, <laughs> yeah. where he calls the bank and the banker says, your bank balance is yeah. 100. Bro, listen, 33 million US. I don't know about you guys, you but bro, me, I need 70 something more. No, 67 more. <laughs> Why? 100 M. You want 400 M. You want what? 100 M. Because I once read somewhere, right? 33 M, eh, that's a rapper money. 100 M. Bro, Diddy can pick up the phone. Bro, let me 33. tell you. No. Bro, let me tell you. Let me tell you. 33, if honestly, you have, you're a broke if millionaire. You have two million. Oh, wow. I can tell you, I'm telling you this. This is not even. From experience. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Say it with the chest. No, <laughs> from when you were with these rappers. No, so when I was with these rappers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, with my bro. Yeah, and, you know. <laughs> I can tell you, bro, like, there's a time when two million, four million mm. Mm. was deposited into an account. Mm. You know, into a new bank account, right? Mm. The bank gave gave this person this person uh, ten thousand US dollars as a thank you for bringing yeah, yeah, that yeah. amount of that money your your business to us yeah yeah Jeez. ten thousand dollars that's one point two m mm. the bank says you've brought your four m here's your here's here's ten thousand dollars to welcome you yeah when you have that kind of money when you have like the the in excess of the four five millions. Life is different, mm. and doors open. You, you have a, a Simon was saying last week. You have a seat at the table with people you probably wouldn't have a seat at the table with. Like yeah, with because you know even when I was watching an interview with him, one of his other interviews that he did, that he mentioned some names like he mentions Jay Brown, who's I think is Jay Z's business manager mm-hmm. and stuff. 
my bro who was an accountant in Boston wouldn't be in the same room as those guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But my bro, the the business man, is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm trying to say. Yeah. The point I'm trying, so it opens up some some doors for you, right? Yeah. But the point I'm trying to make is this: in the context, everyone's different. And in my context, my context is like, guess what, man. Man's had an incredible journey thus far, and I've enjoyed every day of what I've done. Mm. But it is figuring a point. It will figure a point where I'm like, you know what? Now I just want to chill. I just want to chill. I, I don't want to. I don't want to be. For. I don't want to be chilling at the age of sixty-four and seventy. I want to be chilling now, so that like, fam, I'm in the house today. You know, what my biggest problem was mm. what size TV to put into the spare room. <laughs> <laughs> no, legit. And that's a small problem, but you know what? End of the day, it's still a problem. It's still a problem. It's a yeah. fucking yeah. problem. It's yeah. like, okay, what are we doing for the rest of the year? Are we are we spending Christmas in Europe? Are we going to Ghana? Those are the problems I want to have now. Yeah. yeah. I don't want these things. problems because I don't understand and I don't have money, money. But but here's the thing. And I'll <clears throat> so 33 years ago, right? So Mudavadi, he's around 64. You can confirm mm. this, right? Because mm-hmm. I know his age mates with uh, Uhuru. All, uh-huh. huh? oh. Uhuru, Gideon, all of them. Right. So they're all age mates, right? Oh, I see what she did there. Right? Oh. So I saw one of the cabinet secretary, one of the MPs who was interviewing him He's said... 62, bro. Yeah, they're about. 62. Just 62. Yep, 62. They're about, right? <coughs> so I saw one of the cabinet... The, the, the thing is... The MPs asking him, yo, 1989, I was three years old. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Here you are, 33 years later, and you're still in power. He yeah. was a cabinet secretary in. Then. But my thing is this, you can't really blame Musalia Mudavadi. Mm. Here's the thing, this has been a career for him. What else right. do you expect him to do? Oh, this okay. is what he knows. This is what he knows, because mm. my man was actually plucked out of, uh, he was straight he, out of Nairobi University or, or some whatever. shit. Yeah, I remember that story. Yeah. I'm, mm. I stand corrected, if I'm not wrong. There's a story like that. Boom, public service. Mm. Straight mm. up. So Bro, what, what do you expect? Do. And also, at um, he's now what he was what twenty something at yeah. that age, yeah. twenty eight or something like that, twenty nine, yeah. bro. At twenty nine, you're a cabinet secretary in the Moy government yeah. in the Golden Bag thing. You've been around power. You've been a dep- deputy PM, bro. Bodyguards all my life, bro. bro listen, no, let I me get just it. get to the grave like this, man. No, I get it. I get it. I just don't know how. So you think it's a life, but but, but also but also I think we're talking about it from lack of experience. Oh, I for lack think of money. So. Yeah. But yeah. also I think it's also that thing for keeping the power. You Bro, get what I, I mean? Fam, let me so tell you. If I leave this position let, today, am I gonna have the same power that fam, I have always had? Okay. I, I, I told you guys here on this podcast when I went to the inauguration at State House, mm. fam, I can't judge these people. You feel the actual power. Mm. And I think Austin, who's our Gava plug, can tell us. Bro, <laughs> that power with the presidency, with the cabinet secretaries, with what, 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 is mm. actually quite something. Mm. Addictive, you, yeah? It's mm. very addictive. That's like mm. a bad crack habit. <laughs> you're wow. just at the crack store. You're like, listen, mm. I got 4.4B, but uh, I could I use a top up. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 think I, it's get the it. power. I get it. It's the power. That, because, but all right, fair enough. He's been in politics for 30 odd years. Mm. Yeah. Let's give him the benefit of the doubt. Fam, Moses Korea, you pronounce it for me, Korea. Korea. Fuck you. <laughs> I didn't say it. No, how he says it. He told that journalist, Moses <laughs> Korea, everything happens in this country, you blame. Fuck you. <laughs> and the <laughs> guy <laughs> left. <laughs> He did? <laughs> Live on oh, TV. Wow. <laughs> so anyway, he's 51. <laughs> Yo. And his net worth, he says that he's 700. Worth 750 million. No, yeah. Bro, I don't know whether it's been born in Gatondo, where the president's <laughs> from. Money just falls and hits you because, oh, my wow. God. Yo, I had 750. I was like, you know what's crazy? Because the guy who's running for finance, uh, who's been nominated finance, right? Mm. The former well, central. 900 million. He said 900. Oh. 900 million. So also, I didn't dwell it. 700? Seven hundred. I'm yeah. no. I'm worth eight hundred and fifty-one million, including twenty two hundred and thirty-one camels. I can see wow. that. Apparently, two hundred and thirty-one camels is worth thirty million. Yeah. Now that's what that's what I'm that's what I've read on Twitter. It might mm, be mm, true. Mm. So David, indeed, the um, guy of of the Economist guy, said yeah, yeah. that there are people in Nairobi who are driving five hundred k cars. <laughs> And their cars on a car loan, and they're laughing at pastoralists who have camels worth, worth thirty yeah. million or whatever, which is like double their cars. Yeah, 
triple their oh, car, but uh, even yeah. more. The po- I, I didn't understand the connection there, but it was yeah, 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 I, I can see that because he's talking about okay, cool guys are on car loans, what laughing at those guys. Yet those guys are way more wealthy based yeah. upon yeah. livestock they that they have. But yeah. and also, but it, it also depends on if anyone wants to buy a camel. Mm. I don't know if yeah. we don't know. Right. Like I don't know if you go up to them sides there and it's like, yo, <laughs> you see that my camel? G. It's a nicer thing. Yo, That's did you see that? This is a twenty thirteen. So so what about year of birth? So so but 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 can you listen? What's the best day to buy a camel? Wednesday, cause it's hump day. Oh, uh, you're catching on. <laughs> I saw the angels. Just like I know where this Yo, is going. Yo, guess what? Then oh. guess what? Guess what? Guess who? The best day to buy a camel is camel. Is like my camel tow tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> tomorrow. Oh, stop! Wow! 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 We're really pushing it. We are really pushing Yo, it. That <laughs> joke. That joke. G was the hump. Oh. <laughs> he went over it. Bro, bro, where are these guys getting this money from, bro? <laughs> I bro, need to know. Listen, listen, let me tell you. I was talking to some guy the other day. He's a designer. I think you know the guy. The guy told me he went to uh, <clears throat> he went to do some business with some Somalis. The guy asked him, so you're 30-something. You're not married. The guy said, me, I have 12 children. Huh? And the guy told him, listen, this year, this country, very, very soon, we shall actually have a Somali president. Wow. Bro, <laughs> Somalis don't play, bro. It's they true, got bro. a lot of money. And I'm yet to see. Here's the thing. And I can be corrected for mm. this. But I honestly believe there's more Somalis in business than in employment. It's true. It's true. And you know, they, they literally try to... Um, yeah literally buy off like land and mm. equity basically Cash. from people there's some land that uh, family manenos mm. these guys came and they were just like initially they were like we want this building yep. we'll give you half Fam. cash and half cash today the other cash tomorrow they don't be playing cash in millions <laughs> instant and Mer- it's now and now keep chumba keep murukuman murukuman yeah <laughs> this <laughs> guy is worth how much he's worth the wilbur <laughs> 550 million and a wheelbarrow. And a wheelbarrow. Ooh, ooh, I ooh, really ooh, laughed ooh, when I saw that. I see that, man. <laughs> and a wheelbarrow. Okay. 550M. 550M. It was like, a confidence. Has he served as a minister? He's, he's served as an MP and as a senator. Mm. Right. Yeah. I think this should be what? Uh, the last senator term so, was what? Sec- first, I okay. think. Okay. So here's or the thing. So, yeah. Here's, and, here's, and here's a very pertinent question. Mm. As you know, as budding entrepreneurs, all of you, right? All of us, right? You know how hard it is for you to hold down a job mm-hmm. mm. while doing a side hustle. Yeah. yeah. Right? Like even for our fast guys, we wake up in the morning, we go and do our jobs, right? Mm-hmm. But then if we're doing our hustles outside, fam, it's sometimes your job will call you and say like, for example, Saturday, job's like, oh, we're doing activation at, at Quidva. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, it, and in my mind, I'm like, fuck. You know what? On Saturday afternoon, I plan to do this, 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 mm. this, yeah. this, right? Bro, if these guys are able to successfully create this level of personal wealth, yep. mm-hmm. when are they having time to do the job for which they're actually paid? You can't create 550 million part time. True. Then it's is, not. You can't. And there's another guy who said he was worth 300 last year, but now he's worth 400 yeah. million this year. You can't do that part time. It's not possible. Yeah. So but the question is, if these guys are so successful mm. in creating personal wealth, how comes their knowledge hasn't trickled down to fixing our economy? How is How are the people in charge of our governance and our economy so amazingly able yeah, to, to get create rich personal wealth yeah. Yeah. and create personal wealth but they can't do it for the comp- for the country. You know, like I'll use I use a classic example, Aisha Jumo, and I love what Aisha Jumo was talking about. She even cried at some point, broke down mm-hmm. and said, broke down and said that um, my parents couldn't afford. We to, don't care about tears. Yeah, you get. <laughs> uh, for me, I thought that was all theatrics, right? And she said two hundred and fifty, bro. And she's former MP Malindi. She's yeah. have you them? Have you get? She said hundred M or two fifty, some, some shit like that, right? Hundred M. But I what was actually crazy was listening to her and listening to. Um, she said, "I've got the properties." It was about hundred M properties, uh-huh. and all of that is I'm making my current income is from uh, pension. Yeah. Off of me being no. an MP, and I looked at it, I was like, "Bro, the coast." 
You guys have been to Kilifi, yeah. all of these areas. The poverty levels yeah. are absolutely crazy. crazy. So, and let me tell you, she says my financial net worth is 100 million. You might be wondering why we have the laptop today because yeah. we're not misquoting nothing, right? <laughs> my neck. She says her net worth is 100 million. Yeah. Right? Fam. Do you? That's just under. Uh, just, that's like a, just, a million dollar. Just under a million dollars. Yeah. You know how hard it is to make a million dollars. It's yeah. hard, unless you're in the loto. Right. Exactly. Yeah. yeah so like, the question what? I'm asking is, and I don't understand how nobody is. None of these people are asking this question. If our guys are so able Very to create good. Yep. personal wealth, I think. A, how much time are they spending to do it? Yeah. And B, how comes they've been unable to do it for the country? I think it's the it's like the Karl Marx theory of the the poor stay stay poor and the rich get richer. So they're able to actually do all these things. I'll go back to the power aspect mm. or make all this money because they have the power. Right. So they will get all the tenders, they will get all the business. That's why majority of like politicians that have side hustles for, you know, right. supplying shit and whatnot. Yeah. Then they're the ones who actually get the business. Right. So when the country comes and says this is a budget for I don't know, creating the roads or creating a building, mm. so of course they're gonna say I have a business or so give it to this guy then right. they'll equally make the money so they, they, they'll of course make more money no, I and will not actually think about us wananchis mm. let's call it because but, they're thinking about how they're going to better oh, themselves but, but, it's, but also, you know, it's also guys, very selfish guys it looks so bad for us guys to actually be talking about this right and also the nation right and I've seen guys talk about it in the sense that we voted a government based upon a hustler narrative yeah. and mm. all of these guys and I get G's point right that clearly goes to show you that the levels of corruption are just insane because yeah. you can't justify how mm. is it that you've been able to make this money off of what right mm. What is it? What, yeah, is, what is, it? is it that you're mm. doing? Off of what? You know, it, by, there's only one way. Because by the way, because even if right, even if we we actually sat down and said, "Cool, how much does an MP earn?" Yeah, it's like, it's uh, like right, a like seven hundred or something, right? Mm. So seven hundred times what? Let's do the math. Mm. Times twelve, uh, yeah. times five. Yeah. So you do like double terms. Maybe that cash goes to. Like what? How much can that get to? Maybe a hundred M or some mm. shit. Maybe something like that. But you have expenses. There's so many different things that you're doing. But guys will come into you. Oh, mm. give us this. Give us that, bro. Mm. Like we that all we well. we earn salaries here, right? Right. And bro, you end up saving a mere. Yeah. You get, yeah. and that is the same thing for those guys. So explain to me how you've been able to amass that. It's all based upon cool. You have power to be able to say, "Hey, right. Ash, is how mm. go to this ministry like this, like that." Mm. Get the job. Mm. I'm looking at the um the the how much a member of parliament gets seven hundred and ten thousand. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Then you Are have all the allowances the, and all yeah, of that the shit. allowances yeah. as yeah. well. Because if you bring in the allowances, then probably what? Like only rent is what you're paying and food? Because they get car car allowance. Mileage, so that says they get mileage. mileage. Yeah. Seven ten monthly, they get a motor vehicle reimbursement of seven point five for purchasing a car not exceeding three hundred thousand CC. <laughs> Yeah, the yeah. purpose of this is to allow the MP to, un to undertake official duties, so they can mm. go and buy a car for seven point five and do their thing. Yeah. Okay. MCAs so, uh -huh. get three hundred or something. No, one. This is a one seventy five. No one way. One hundred and forty four. Oh, no! I yeah. thought they were like on more though. Yeah, that's this according to an article on um, Tuku, Tuko. Oh so, yeah. wow! So maybe it's changed, but this is this was. August 20th, 2022. A couple of months back. Interesting. Wait, because, okay. okay, we know people who earn equally as much, if not more. 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 Mm. They're, they're not worth that much. Anyway, are you Even serious? Even side hustles. Hmm? Are you serious about running for, for, for politics? Bro, 2020, 20, what is it? 2027. 27, yeah. Fam, listen. Y'all are going to call me uh, Big C. <laughs> yeah, what, you, what are you going for? You going for MC? Me, MC? I'll go MP, bro. Okay, I'm in MC. Yeri next weekend. Yeah. Don't forget it. I'll, I can be your communications Fam, something, just, something. Just, just make it happen. Because we are going to plunder Neri County. <laughs> oh, seriously. You guys just need to get your RLs wrong. Because yes. you guys can already say, right? You just need to practice. Right? Every, say, right. be, every night before you go to bed. We have to plunder. You can't say, you can't say, you can't say, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't yes. it? Rubbish. Rubbish. Let me tell you exactly what we're going to do. 
right? <laughs> when you start to campaign, episode 181, we are going to delete this. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, there's like two other ones that do we know, need to do delete. You know, do you know what? Do you know what's <laughs> going to go back through all of the ones where we spoke about corruption <laughs> and we're going to delete them? Do you know what's actually going to be such a great scam if I like end up MP of Nyeri Town? Mm. Bro, you guys are eloquent. You guys just need to come open R and L. <laughs> school yeah yeah every single day guys just come to <laughs> learn how to give me an r like all day guys homework the homework could be voice notes by the way wow. you know, we don't have any pol- political patronage <coughs> so we have to like bootstrap our way up so at this point <laughs> i want to thank dscv for keeping the lights on this episode Bruh, I love it's it. all about it's all about the world it's all about the world it's all about, the, the wor- it's, it's all it's about, all about qatar qatar man yeah, world of football yeah man so yeah. the 20th of november it's all about qatar 64 matches man it's all gonna be live on dstv mm. nice. make sure that you copy your decoder pop quiz how much is the dstv decoder Three thousand. Three thousand nine hundred ninety nine. i like nice. that and i suggest you get a dstv installer mm-hmm. don't be like me <laughs> Be smart about this. Yep. Be smart about it. Don't be yeah, like man. Me. So all of the games are going to be live. So we're talking about Qatar. You know, a lot of restrictions out in Qatar, mm. but it can literally be in your living room. But you you're just c- watching By and enjoying way, yourself. Can I just say? Yeah. Finally, I've joined the league of televisions above 60 inches. Oh. Yes. All right. All right. So oh, oh, you, oh, you so, damn bought a new one. So I'm yeah, I bought a new one. So I'm looking forward to- What are you to at? 99? No, 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 I'm on 65 inches. Oh, okay. okay. Sizes and everything. (laughs) (laughs) That's how you work with it. (laughs) But yeah, so I'm looking forward to watching as many of those 64 games which will be available on DSTV. Yeah. And don't forget the app as well. Yeah, the, the app. Because I actually stream, you mm-hmm. know, like I said, we're talking about getting your, your decoder installed yeah. by a proper person. Yeah. yeah. Fab, you know, to this day, I'm still streaming on my app. Yeah. But I go to DSTV today, they're very kindly sending somebody to come and finally mm. put my Explorer in. Sure, but it's sure. really, actually, both of them really come through because I know, like, for my dad, when mm-hmm. he's outstation, he streams it right, right, on right. the app when he's around. He's you, box, you'll yeah. find him recording every Bruh. single game. But my <laughs> I find most people nowadays are streaming though. A lot of people yeah, it does, it does. Yeah. yeah. So the DVS app, man, uh, it's Get actually it. available. Yep. Google mm. Play Store. We're gonna put, actually, we're mm-hmm. going to put a link to the DSTV app in the description yep. of the podcast. Yep. So that's, that's what we're going to do. The box. Uh, yeah. Boom. Chachisha, Mechi. Yeah. In, in Qatar, Qatar. we're gonna say it again. You caught, you Chachisha, caught, you caught me out, bro. All right, let's say it again. One, Chach- two, well, no, no, okay. You have to count me, and I have to. I have to get the visual in front of me, bro. Give me a one, one. Whoa. Give me a two, you guys, two. You just don't want me to be involved in this conversation, right? I'm ready now. Chachisha, what is ha- one, two, three? Chachisha, Mechi in Qatar. With DSTV. I love it. I love it. So there you have it, man. Some giveaways to give away. Don't Mm -hmm. go anywhere. I've got some really cool DSTV giveaways to give away. And we're also giving away a lot of stuff on our social media pages as well. So if you love football, you love DSTV. And I've got some goodies to give away. (coughs) All righty. Who else are we cancelling? I'm not cancelling anyone. Yeah? No, Kanye West. We've spoken about Kanye West. Let's <coughs> with him. Yeah. Can we talk about Are Flintstones? Are you working? Yes, Ooh. today though. Oh, by the way. Huh? What? What, did you, what, did, what did you say? <laughs> what is this? Uh, this the Kanye West thing is, my God, you got condoms on her. <laughs> We're canceling Kanye. Can I like, say, let I just want to resell them. Like, <laughs> let, me, let me ask you this. When you wear these shoes, do you feel like a huh? genius? Listen, let me, when I wear these shoes, I, I just think to myself, no one man should have all this power. Oh. I, feel, I feel stronger. What, what, what's the no, power? Like I, feel, I also feel like, you know, wait till I get my money right. Uh, <laughs> Why is Kanye wait doing this I to us? And I, feel, and then I, I said right. to people, like, people said, do you realize that I'm a champion? Oh. <laughs> you know, I think I can touch the sky. Yes, what the about, you know, all of, all, of the, all, of, all of this is giving me, you know, vibes of blood on the leaves. Yeah, oh, wow. exactly. Blood on the leaves, man. Right? You know, but, but you know what? But you know what? All said and done. I can't wait to touch the sky. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. Because, you know, was, it, was that before graduation or after, after graduation? graduation. But, but I'm a college dropout. But, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. You know, those sandals are pretty dope. Uh. But watch out. The gold diggers may take them. <laughs> true, true, true. <laughs> but you know who else wore sandals? I'm so impressed with you guys. You know, <laughs> you know who else wore sandals? Oh, yeah. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus walks. <laughs> 
about it. It's not just about it. <laughs> yeah, hey, hey, it's hey. Just, yo, yeah, it's right not just about diamonds, bro. <laughs> yeah, it's not. From Sierra Leone. Or anywhere else. <laughs> that's why we made good radio. That's I why. Tell you. That's why. Oh, I love mm. it. And prepped, and prepped, man. Yeah, man. Mm. Yeah, so. Can you believe that these guys actually split us up? What the fuck was that all about? <laughs> anyway, yo, I, yo I, saw, I saw your new co host. <laughs> What's his name? He's Ooh. not your co host, though. Right, he's, 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 a, cool he's, guy. he's a sports guy. He's cool. Oh, he's a, cool he's a sports guy. guy. Yeah, but yeah. I'm, I'm trying to work on him, you know. Oh, I saw you followed me on Instagram. I was like, who the fuck is this? No, I'm trying Not to on thingy. But yeah, I, think, I think he has a lot of potential. Yeah. yeah. Um, What's his name? A lot of potential. Brian. His name's Brian. 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 He's a wow, wow daddy. Wow, well, daddy. He's actually on um, the wild card with Eric and Ah, this week. Yeah. Dope, dope. Yeah, yeah. So I'm trying to just, you know, I always said this is this is the last one. The last one. You the said that one. after us. <laughs> no, no, this, this is the last. This is the last. No, one. But he's cool guy. I met him at. Uh, he usually comes in on Saturdays as well. Uh, yeah. So that's why I was just like, "Who are you with that deep voice, boy?" Like, <laughs> everyone, everyone, be like, "Wow, daddy, your voice does Yay. not suit you." He's like slender and shit, right? No, uh, he's, no not he's not slender. Not slender he's skinny. <laughs> oh. Anyway, moving on. What moving else on. we got? What else I've been we got? Um, something different. It's the voice. <laughs> I feel like we had our notes. You with a laptop? No, 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 no. I, I, you asked me who we're canceling. Uh huh. Marvel, bro. Why are we canceling Marvel? Fuck Marvel. <laughs> oh, bro, Wakanda. Shout sh- sh- going out to Nzaro. Nzaro sent me a message in the morning. He's like, bro, Wakanda's in East Africa. Yeah. yeah. Why they gonna do it in West it's, Africa? Isn't that the border of Kenya and Tanzania? Or some shit it's like that. Try right in there. Wakanda. I've been there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> in the, in the, in the, <laughs> what kind of bullshit is that? <laughs> Not the reaction, but, but but it's crazy. Like like man, I saw that, and um, so it's a collaboration between uh, Walt Disney, yeah, uh, Africa Film something, and Nigeria. Fuck them. But it's funny how they always move. Like anything African to Americans or the Western Bro, world. Is listen, look at Lion West. King. Lion King, they 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 yeah. got. Tell me, am I wrong? Is it Lion King East African? Yeah, yeah. they don't have no. There's lion no lions in fucking thingy. Nigeria. Yeah, they went and did a whole thingy, a whole collaborative and album. The album with Beyonce, yeah. fucking Shota Wale, Burner Boy, Yo, no one, no nobody Kenyan. from they, this region. They should have just gone and t- what, what do you call him? My favorite rapper. They should have just called him t- uh, Trio Mio to yes. just say, oh, oh, <laughs> yeah. I <laughs> got <laughs> <it>. <laughs> No, but that's what I'm saying. But like they, they do, they do a stir you all the but time. But you know, they here's do. the thing. But you know, this thing it's deeper than this, guys. You guys are actually not looking at Why? the depth. What is the problem? Happening? Like this is tough. Like this is what you call a piss take. Like yeah. these guys are taking us, slapping us, and all of that. Like how the fuck are you gonna do the premiere? To Wakanda in Lagos Fam, with I what d- electricity? <laughs> exactly. I mean, I know he's a black panther, not the fucking blackout. Like, panther. like, like, you know, you know, you know. They just need to say. They just need to say. <laughs> the, is blackout the blackout panther. The blackout panther. Sorry, the blackout panther. Like, my friend, I know you have come to. Have me. you watched blackout panther? <laughs> but you, without, you know, what they're spinning. Yeah. Without a blackout, you can't have a black panther. <laughs> Your guys will just this be the spin off. Guys will just be guys will just be in that cinema. Bro, Shawo. <laughs> fam, by the way, I need boy, by the way, let me tell you, fam. There's gonna be 99 Nollywood versions of Black Panther. Right. Yo, Blackout Panther, Blackout Black Panther, pants, Black. Out Panther, Panther, Black. Panther, Panther Shawo. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, everybody knows me. I love West Africa. I yeah. love bro. Nigeria. I love Ghana. But that's a marvel of taking the piss, bro. Ma- you know, here's the that. thing. Guys, are even gonna be late for that premiere. They're even a podcast in Nigeria, <laughs> bro. Like w- the traffic situation. Imagine. Like who's gonna be at the cinema? But no guys will just be. Guys will just, the traffic's gonna be so bad. VI. By the time the VIPs get there, they're gonna be blacked out. <laughs> blacked out. Yo, so yo, that 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 for um, me, I was just like, piss. wow. Like, uh, it's but, the piss, but then sorry. again, why why should it have been done in Kenya? Because we have IMAX, we have fucking. Oh, there's Our a new one. Is a top tier, honey. Fam, we could have like you know we could have gone all out on that fam. Fact. Like, yeah, we Fact. speak better English as well. Yeah, fam. By uh, the way, uh, how those far accents in. In in like in any of the movies, let's just let's say this. Is Lupita Even in, the, in, King. in this one? Yeah, she is. She yeah. is, she so is she are there any Nigerians in this one? I think there's one. Yes. Yeah, there's one. Yeah, yes. yeah, there's one. Ooh, there's one. Like but, but 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 she's not as famous as Lupita. He or um, she? Yeah, exactly. Lupita. Yo, Lupita should have just told them. Listen. 
Let's just do it Kisum sit. Hey, hey, by the hey, lake. Omera. Omera, what is? Hey, what is? Hey, hey. You, you can red carpet like never before. Like never before, <laughs> my friend. Omeva um, ngapi? Hey, good <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you. What is happening today? I love you it. Know, you 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 know, stop, stop, stop. you know, you I am just imagining a, a Black Panther <laughs> premiere in Kisumu. <laughs> bro, I got, by the way, Kisumu. That shit, yo. You know, I've never been to Kisumu. You, yo, what? bro. I've never been. We need, to, we we need to do Kisumu, man. We need, let's actually. Let's plan a trip. Have, like, generally, even out of our pockets. Yeah. The next time that we have, when everybody's off work, yep. let's go Kisumu for a weekend. I'm down. Let me tell you. Kisumu, so the last time I played, I played at a place called um the club the club club the place in in kisumu so there's a guy there's a guy there yeah and he's there with his chick mm. fam this guy was the quintessential luo bro yeah. <laughs> so he's drinking his beer the chick is sitting down there right and his seat is empty and it's right next to the dj booth so me you know like end of the day my floating hold on hold on hold on guess who's calling who who's that your daughter why does she call every day i Baby? know I hey mama he's impeccable you know it's wednesday what am i doing if you call me wow it's wednesday guess what i'm doing hi jojo huh no it's wednesday it's not yeah i'm recording the podcast maybe i'll call you later okay bye love you does it say it with your chest See love ya. you <laughs> at you what at you what love you all right you. bye 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 <laughs> So, uh-huh. so, yeah, Yo, so listen. my man's got his beer. Mm. And his man's just standing up there. And it's just like that. It's like that. He's just standing up there with his chick sitting down next. So, me, I'm like, my man's wearing like Yeezys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. he was wearing but slides in the club and all yeah. that. Just standing there. And his chick is sitting on there. So, me, what the, is? Mis- the mischief maker, boss. <laughs> I had to go and sit in that chair, bro. The look I got, I got up and moved fast very fast yeah very fast my friend uh, then, uh, until he established that i was a dj yeah then i was i was back at the table and, and then i was cool but before then the look i was giving i was like he's like he's, he's like omera oh, he's like hey you you should be dj <laughs> <laughs> so didn't you <laughs> wow. you have the worst new accent ever <laughs> yeah crazy man but oh, i love wow. i love kisumu your kisumu's dope man kisumu's always, remember the time we went we had a road trip oh, road trip man we we we, we were in what? the Wish. By the way, let we me need ask a question. To, uh, why? I mean, you still do like the odd road trip here, but yeah. right, bro, now for me, the idea of driving the Kisumu, I don't think I can do it. Those days we were like jumping in the wish. Boom, Let's go. do it. <laughs> do you think it's because we've changed cars? Because I realized that my road trip days finished when I went German. Because all the back of oh. my mind, I'm thinking, well, I will not be the one whose car's coming back on the flat, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you can't say that, That's man. Come on. No, like, come on. No, no, no. It I've can make seen, it to I've coast. Seen. It can. I actually, I'm thinking about going down to coast. Just drive. Driving now? I when? don't actually recall. Um, when in your car? Some November or something. We can go in your car? Yeah. So, yeah, I'm November. In. Boom, just. my car right there. <laughs> I'll even help you drive, but, but, but we'll go in your but, car. But, but, but you know, we can't, like, the, the, the like, it's very low. I, I don't think Ashley can. You, you you can be in the front. Yeah. No, no, no. Wow. Ash, Ash, what Ash, you trying to Ash, say? Ash, no, listen, no, no. I was I'm about to say, gym. listen, let me save this shit. My car can't see three people, like on a road, right? So here's the thing. So what we're going to do is this. G's going to fly you and I can do the road trip. Did you see me saving you like that? <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> okay, also, listen, I, do, I personally don't like driving long distance. I'd rather yeah. fly. So you can drive. We'll find you there, me and you. Yeah, but, <laughs> yeah but, but I'm really content. I enjoy it, but also I think for me it's a time thing. Yeah, um, like why, yeah. Am I, why am I on the road I've, and I've, I can be I've, sipping na- my... Na- my Naivasha's okay, yeah. Nakuru. Think, you know the problem I think with these road trips is that like obviously, if, let's say you're going to Nakuru, right? Mm. Mm-hmm. You're going to Nakuru. You're going for a beat down. Places, right? <laughs> for a beat down. Shout out to Otis, yeah? Right? It's like in between here and Naivasa, there's very little, and um, Naivasa, there's very little to really do. Mm. True. I think that uh, what viewpoint? I used, viewpoint, you stop at viewpoint. But yeah. after well, that, you know, after that, like so, I, I, I think that like especially like in the states where you could be doing a road trip, you can literally stop every couple of hours, mm. every. For if you wanted to, but there's something interesting happening. I just find that once you once you go past Mulalongo and you're going yeah. out 
to Mombasa. You go to Machakos. You can stop at Machakos, I guess, if you want. Tea tot. I've never been to Machakos. Oh, yeah. What? Really? Yeah, yeah. But, but then again, I feel like you guys are forgetting, man. If Andy was here, he'd be like, inject road trip. <laughs> or he'd just be over here, shower. <laughs> <laughs> Andy, 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 Andy would be like, <laughs> <laughs> now we're boarding. <laughs> now we're Now we're boarding. Now we're boarding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Andy. Hey, Andy, man. Happy Yo, birthday, bro. Happy can birthday. I tell you guys something? Uh-huh. Hey, my my cleaning lady has been watching porn in my house. I think she's been doing bad manners on my couch, too, guys. What? I swear to you. Like, I think she's been, like, rubbing her... Oh my hey! She's been flicking now that bean. Now we're in jacks. <laughs> now we're in jacks. Now we're in jacks. What? Let me tell so, you. So how'd you find out? So I've been suspecting it. Uh. It's been a while. So mm-hmm. the first time I suspected, I got back home. I switched on my TV. It's on Netflix. I'm like, I wasn't on Netflix when I left. It was YouTube. Mm. Then I was like, whatever. So I go to continue watching and I'm seeing like 365 days. Then I'm seeing other like really sexual content. I'm like... This is oh. not me. I mean, I know where to go. <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. But why am I watching this shit again? Anyway, so I was just like, anyway, it's okay. So I told uh, someone I'm seeing, I was just like, eh, I think this lady is being a little dodgy with the content that she's watching. And she's not there. That's my main problem. So I, I, I kind of, I didn't even set her up. But now, when was it? Last week. Last week, thir- she, came, she usually comes on Thursdays. So Thursday, I get home earlier. This is mm. like 2 p.m. Then I found her. I find her in the living room, like fixing something. I'm like, hey, that's weird. So I'm checking. The, the bucket is all the way in the bathroom. So I'm just like, no, so why is she here? Anyway, so I switch on my TV. I'm on my phone. I didn't look up. I look up. Guys, mm. <laughs> this sis was on YouTube watching mm. literal porno. <laughs> Where? On YouTube. I check. Yes, I check the find search. That shit? So I, I, I did like back, back. Then I was like, wait a minute, what did I just see? So I go to my search history. I haven't took a picture. Let me, let me read what was on the search. Wow. <laughs> let me read what was on the search. First one. <laughs> Where is it? Wait, 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 wait. Is she still working? First for you? one was Pono Pono live. Then the second one was porno videos. Wow. <laughs> then I, I realized my seat was warm, so I was just like, no, she's been sitting wow. here. But, but well, look, let's, let's break that down. Let's break it down, honestly. It's like, you're in the wrong. Why? Because first of all, how dare you get home <laughs> early yeah. just to check? Like, yeah, who, who like, are you? Like, fam, and, and if she's... Let me ask What's the problem? <laughs> Let me ask a question. Does she clean your house well? No, she's not Tara. Well, I tried. Oh shit, I tried. So <laughs> why is every I told I told Kevin about so, this because I told Kevin I need a new cleaning lady. So he calls me and he's laughing and he's just like, "Why are you interrupting her not though?" Exactly. <laughs> but 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 like, I'm I'm I'm, 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 I'm just I'm just I'm just concerned with why the bucket was not in the living room. <laughs> Stop. I need boys. <laughs> it's the answer for everything. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're, you're wrong. Like end of the day, like it's like it's like come on. If like, she's getting her, if she's getting her nut, and you're just like literally walking in. Women hate women. <laughs> Yo, like like. Shao. What the fuck is happening? But right let me now? ask you this. <laughs> The, the deeper question is this: You have told us about your sex toys on the podcast, right? I do not want to mention them. Oh the my oh, 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 yeah. god! No, 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 you gay. But can I tell you how I set her up as well? No, 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 no. Has uh-huh. she got into the stash? Wait, the treasure chest. This is test. where I'm telling you. I'm, I'm, make, I'm gonna make sure my mom doesn't listen to this. How I set her up? When I saw, I was suspect about it, so I decided I'm gonna split my toys in like different places. Oh my! This and this God. is how I've confirmed, like for real, for real, she's really been busting a nut with that shit. Mm, so I put them in different places. There's one cup place I usually put them. So I put them in the first, um, like side table in my uh-huh. room. Then the second side table where they were. Then I put some other ones where I like put my lotion and shit. How do I walk into my bedroom? Mm. I check the first place, nothing. I check the second place, nothing. Then their usual storage, that drawer was open and there was a towel over them. 
Tell me I'm not. Tell me I'm crazy. I'm not crazy. Next question. <laughs> now that you're in the hot seat. Here's the question. Like, 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 like. Have you, have you, have? Do you have that measuring thing? You know, like you, you, you do left, right on a battery, and it does. <laughs> No, I don't have that. Are the, are the batteries, like, are they rechargeable? I don't know. I've been soaking them in, like, that. <laughs> I'm about damn. to throw them away. Like, like, you know, this is actually... I have so many deep. questions. Like, Ask. So, 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 like, which one do you think she's using the most? I, I feel like the, the two that I'm suspecting. Uh-huh. Yeah, because there's this one... This is such a great interview. There was, <laughs> there was once I got home and one didn't have battery at all. I was just like... That's weird. <laughs> so I thought it had just like over vibrated. You know what? Let me tell you true story. Since we're talking about sex toys, <laughs> so <laughs> oh, you got one. <laughs> Look at you see Calvin's face. face. <laughs> His face is lit up. So I recently had a guest at my house, right? And she, um, she, 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 she was around for a few days. So she went to TZ. So she says to me. When she's gone, she says, have you been in my room? I'm like, no, I'm not going in your room. Because I don't go in my spare room anyway, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah. She's like, okay, <clears throat> if can I go in the room and, and like, check for some... She said, <laughs> there's a silver thing somewhere in the bed. First, so my mind is like, wait a minute. I'm Because I'm clueless. Yeah. Mm-hmm. She's like, okay, no, 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 no. Has, your, is, has Halsey come? Has, has Maureen come? I'm like, yeah, she came on Monday. She goes, okay, ask her if she saw this silver thing. And I'm like... <laughs> Like what do you? T- I'm like we're grown. Like she, what do you? What do you? I'm like, oh my god! In my <laughs> fucking bedroom, my sp- like. So let me have you bunch the bed shits. Questions. Like, so when you travel, do you take like your maybe your micro rocket? I don't know. It's, it's called fucking, a bullet. That bullet. That's what it is. Yeah, it's like it's tiny. Like that weapon of mass how, destruction. Eh? How dare you? <laughs> like that WMD. <laughs> Fam, it's like, how would you feel, right? Like, you have three bedrooms at home. Yeah. Don't ask how I know. <laughs> but you have three bedrooms at home. Like, I'm, you know, I get locked out of my house, but I come over to your house, right? Yeah. And then I'm just lying in your, your guest bed. I just fucking knock one out. Like, how would you feel? I'm fine with that. You are? I'm fine with that. I mean, I'm, like, I've had people fuck in my house. and Jesus Christ. As long as... <laughs> this is getting worse. <laughs> As long as it's not on, like, my... I, I don't even know where... The, you're so the problem is... Anyway, my problem is... You listen, you're there for one... You're there for one job and one job only. Hey, you're on the Blow couch. job! <laughs> it's a wrap! No, no! You can't no. say you're there for one job and no, one I, job only. My that. problem is, A, you're on my couch. Mm. B, why the hell are you using my toys? Toys are not to be used. So and I then sh- I'm thinking, after you've been in my house, I've used that shit. So, <laughs> so now, you need to get a safe. So I sh- Employed her th- so the house could oh. blow. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, no, moving on. No. Why is your house always glowing? First of all, all I, all I oh. say, all I say to you is, is this, and I keep it simple. Like end of the day, like she's <clears throat> human. She has her needs. As long as she's doing her job, who are you? Look at these people who <laughs> have recently. What, which said, job? <laughs> whatever job. <laughs> what are these people who recently said? Like, isn't there, isn't there a guy who? Was sacked for drinking at work. Oh, yeah. And then was reinstated. <laughs> Bro, I saw that, right? So here's the thing, guys. If you guys are planning on uh, drinking at work, right? Mm. Yeah. There's. Uh, <laughs> so here's the thing, right? So the Employment and Labor Relations Court has ruled that mere intoxication is not sufficient reason to sack an employee. Right. And I agree. I so, agree too. So basically, I come <laughs> to work drunk and you want to sack me. Like, like, mad. Like, you like if, I, if mad. I've had a couple of brews. Just a couple. Like, you a know. A brews. Yeah, yeah. Kanye, <laughs> yeah, Kanye would say. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like Kanye would say. Like if I've just had a few and I just say some shit <laughs> on air. Yeah. Bro. Like Mind I, I, your own I, business. No, listen. Yeah. <laughs> Everything's going to be I, all right. Fam, it's like, fam, let's be honest, man. I may... May. 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 Operative word. I'm not confirming or denying, but I might have gone to work a few times intoxicated. Mm -hmm. Did anybody know? Like, I do, like, maybe I've left a club. Fam, I came off a flight last week and went straight to work. (laughs) I will not confirm or deny if I was drinking on that flight. (laughs) (laughs) The point I'm trying to make is, it's like, end of the day, like, as long as you're not, like, operating machinery 
or you're not like operating on people. <laughs> like, mm-hmm. like, fam, what's a liquor That's alcohol true. when you're on radio? Bumble Look, club. It gives you personality too, you know. Bro, I do my best shows when, not that I do shows when I'm lit. It's not but like you I do. I imagine yes. that I do my best shows when I'm lit. I agree. I but agree. I don't go to work it's drunk fun. anymore. Anymore. <laughs> anymore. <laughs> Yeah, man, Are but you? but but the, for me, I saw that as uh, it's it's but like let this, me tell you, it's Calvin and I have come from far. <laughs> oh, we have, we have. Hey. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, what happens if if um you know we happen to have been in environments that we had have. clubs? We have. There was millionaires. Yeah. There was Kiza. There was Skylux. Oh. There was Skylux. You know, like like um, we've we nights just be popping. Yeah, there's like many nights that Calvin and I left the club th- and went straight th- to work. There's been there's <laughs> temptations have been morning. all around. Yeah. <laughs> And those shows have been good. Those shows are fire, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know when you do a show without abandon? Yeah, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, it's it's like that MP from Uganda who says the show's gone. Shui, shui. It's gone, it's, it's gone. gone. It's man. gone. It's gone. That's Listen. the one. Oh, no, I said to you, oh shit, my heart's gone. I said oh you, shit, you know that's I'm reminded me of what? The babe on the podcast. Oh, <laughs> and now we fell off. Fell off. <laughs> She's like, oh my I'm God. Week, though. I'm not scared of taking my half. There you go. Oh, oh by the way, at this, at this week, uh, was international what? Uh, Get back with your ex. No, 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 bald man thingy. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw that. Like, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well I done. They, they what that, are you supposed to say? They said that Vin Diesel is the most attractive bald man in the world. Apparently, is that true? But that's what white people said. Oh yeah. Black let's people say said that. BN. <laughs> 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 Shout out to Ben. Listen, uh, moving swiftly on. Um, before we wrap, have the you watch. watched like? Why? Why is it like aliens always have like veins on their like? They don't have no hair. Like I've always wanted to ask. Dimension. <laughs> <laughs> they go from it's another thick. dimension. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh, oh you <laughs> Yo, no, like you see thing. the green. <laughs> Yo, you, you took that you took that joke you took it and you ran with it yep yep this podcast is shit oh gosh wait Listen. before we move on uh-huh. don't forget to buy our merchandise mm-hmm. um, go check the link out Ash, you know they're whatever. not gonna buy it till you get naked you <laughs> Just, Look, just be I'm like, doing my best, okay? I show you a little bit of arms, a little bit of legs sometimes. <gasps> some cl- <laughs> What's next week? No, send it over to me. We're going to be sending some cups. <laughs> Double D. Listen, oh, um, wow, 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 wow. You, you just need to hold the can cups. Can you get the size b- b- right first, G? Oh, oh, but by the way, so Mike's... Get the size right. <laughs> so Mike's open bras would work, though. But I it's it's, it's it's mm. October. Right? Yes. Uh, it's it's yeah. ca- oh, it's cancer, Ooh. breast cancer awareness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. feel those tits, Let's guys. Let's talk about it next okay. week. Okay. Like, like, so, 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 like, you know, like, you know, but you know, here's the thing, right? Like, Ashley, this may sound bad, but think about it. Like, how, imagine a campaign where you actually showed men how to actually touch the boobies, not sexually, mm. but to actually screen. Yeah, that's their what I'm saying. Or, yeah, that's what I'm saying. And you know, need to like we, show them. That's what I'm talking about. Or, in like the campaign, <laughs> we showed men how to touch the breast sexually. <laughs> Listen, Listen, you guys are mad. <laughs> on the lockdown session, who's on the lockdown this week? It's Kavos- Karoski and a new entry onto the um, channel, JT the Drone. Oh, ah, nice, yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah okay, I guess he cool. encupped it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I guess he has encupped also, it. Also, tomorrow morning, oh. of course, the wake up call. We like, got share, you. subscribe. Guess what? No cup. Oh, shut up, Calvin. Um, <laughs> let's give away some merchandise. So, courtesy of our good friends at DSTV, oh, don't forget, man, mm-hmm. all 64 games are live on From DSTV. Qatar. Um, be here. For, you got to be there for 64 games. Make sure. You guys have made me laugh so much that I'm crying. <laughs> uh, make sure that you, if you're not connected, get yourself a DSTV decoder. Remember, 3,999 Bob mm-hmm. is the special offer right now. And I'm always going to suggest to you to get yourself a DSTV installer as well. Let someone from DSTV come and install it for you. Don't do like... Do it. Like, don't be like G. Don't, don't be like, like, <laughs> like Yeah, man. I can tell you it will end badly. Get First yourself hand. a proper... And, so, and also, thank you for DSTV for finally sending me an installer because I went the wrong route. Go the right route, my friends. Anyway, so um, you can also get the app. You can stream the, the all the games mm-hmm. uh, in from Qatar on the app as well. Steam, stream DSTV. We're going to put a link where you can Down get the, um, the app. And Yo, let me thing. tell you, the, the good thing about the app is this, right? Now, you know, like how Ashley was saying, <clears throat> 
a lot everywhere. of people now have smart TVs, right? Yeah. So essentially, all you need to do is just download the app. Uh -huh. So you download mm -hmm. the app, you follow the very simple prompts. Mm -hmm. Basically, if you know how to subscribe to something, you yeah. will I be I also able to. like, you know... <laughs> But do I say my new 65 inch Come on. Um, TV? <laughs> yeah, it was so easy to install the DSTV app. Exactly. So all of this is going to be available for you because we're checking out. Or 75. Yeah. Well, I can tell you what DSTV looks so good on my TV. Yeah. <laughs> Football looks so good on my TV. You're like, in the screen. Hey, huh? Like I'm in the stadium. <laughs> like you see when it was delayed like, for like 10 minutes last weekend, I was there, bro. Like you, you, you did all of that to watch these players bigger. Players what? Like at the World Cup. <laughs> You just want to watch guys like Bro, Tatisha <laughs> Messi <laughs> in Qatar on my 65 inch Come on. TV. You like, can't tell us. Like anything. you know, babes are gonna be coming to your house to watch, you know, you know, Qatar mm -hmm. from the 20th of November. G's like, oh my god, check out the big screen TV. But they're just there to watch Benzema. I've never seen that many women <laughs> post up Benzema yesterday. Yeah. But women oh, wait, but but women, wait women wait for, I watched that on my 65 inch TV. Come oh, on. But, but <laughs> women wait for you at the finishing line oh. so like Benzema's been great for a long time damn, like he was damn, damn, I don't know what I respect damn. about Benzema to be honest and I'm glad he's going to be at the World Cup who's got the keys to his bimmer <laughs> what I respect about him what I respect about him is the fact that he's played the foil to so many great players mm. and just did it like he celebrated Ronaldo winning all these times yeah. other guys Modric all these guys winning at different points of their career and now it's his time and he's in like I respect that like, I like that you know, the, but I like it man imagine if, if, ima imagine if Pogba had won that oh my god they're dancing fast on the, the stage the well the it. first dance would be a witch doctor <laughs> wow <laughs> does, any, does anybody even still support Manchester United like oh, I that, here we like, go Manchester United I thought that was kind of like that went out is that like is that gone <laughs> man <laughs> like I saw I saw, I saw, I saw you your shot going out to step up I think you get this guy this guy had some really nice videos. I watched the kid walking, the Arsenal kid walking, uh -huh. and then he's like, Oh, the guy, it's two cars. Crazy. Yo, that man, I can't wait for you guys to. So, I, I want to I wanna fall. actually give we're not gonna we're fall though. Top, really? That's the problem, we're not gonna fall though. That's the problem. You guys, like, how many Arsenal, Arsenal jerseys do you have? It's like very, so many, by the way. Like, it's so trash. Like, so. bro, you know how Kanye West says. Mm. This niggas wear suits because they can't dress no more. I feel like it's gotten to you. You wear Arsenal jerseys because you can't dress no By more. By the way, I went viral last week with that Arsenal jersey. <laughs> I saw that. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Everybody yeah. was posting up when Arsenal fans <coughs> had to come anyway, out. <laughs> I want to give away some merchandise, all courtesy of our good friends at DSTV. And I have a crazy question about what's happening in Qatar. Mm -hmm. say, say it for me, come on. Chachisha Mechi. In Qatar. Right. So mm -hmm. my question is, because I've got loads of goodies to give away courtesy of, of DSTV, which team in this year's competition is going to have to travel the furthest to get to Qatar? There are 32 teams competing in Qatar. Mm -hmm. Which team is going to have to travel the furthest? I think I know. I bet you don't. <laughs> Look at wow. I thought I knew. <laughs> no faith. <clears throat> Fam, I spent this afternoon literally looking at all 32 Where's teams your compass? And saying <clears throat> distance from, distance from, and it's very close. Yeah. And it's like, the obvious answer is not the correct answer. So which team is going to have to travel the furthest I know to the get answer. to Qatar? Now, we've got loads of hampers, goodies to give away. Got about 10 of them. So... Don't worry yourself. Oh. Plus, we have a different question that we're going to do on social media. Mm. So if you can't be bothered to work this one out, Gee, like, all you got to do is get the like 31 I've, I've, teams. I've, 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 eh? You know the answer? Yeah. What do you think Guess what? The AT aliens. The ah. AT aliens. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Please. Boy, Calvin, goodbye. Which team, which team's players are going to end up with the most air miles? Ah, it's okay. not what you got might you. think. Do you want to rephrase that question? Mm. No. I mean, it's, you know, it's good how it is. <laughs> don't, 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 don't. We That's the tweet. question. <laughs> Answers. Hit us up. Um, what not, which email should we give out? Or should we give out a... Info at? Info. Info, yeah. yeah. Info at thegoodcompany.co.ke. Mm. That's info at thegoodcompany.co.ke. Which team in the in the competition in Qatar, in which kicks off end of the month, end of, end of November, 
Mm. Which team will have to travel the furthest to get to Qatar? Oh, yeah, man. 20th of November, you know the drill. So, yeah, man, all courtesy of yeah. DSTV. I know how right. to do that math. Okay. All right. Listen, us guys <laughs> out the building. I've really, I've really enjoyed the pod today, by the Same. way. Same. It's been fun. I know. I you think, you, what do you want for Christmas? I know. <laughs> I'm, oh, shit. <laughs> listen. Uh, we were, yo, uh, yo, I was supposed to do a handover for the air fryer, bro. Oh, where's the air fryer? Man, I forgot. See, can we can we buy it tomorrow okay. after the show? We, we, no, no, no. Tomorrow. Can we Thursday, go back yeah, we to can... my Christmas thing first? Uh, you were getting new debt on. Inject. Now we're bodies. <laughs> what is it? Ashley out here? Team, what is it? <laughs> Listen, <laughs> my name is <G> Money. <laughs> I was about to say, Big C. Inject. <laughs> now we're bodies. Now we're bodies. <laughs> what do you think? This guy said you need to disinfect your life. <laughs> 